would say just go for it. There is no other way to think about this. I feel like it's, it's one of those things that is really scary. Um, the fear of rejection might hold you back, but don't let, let that be like something that stops you. Just don't hesitate to trying to approach something that you scare. Just go for it. Oftentimes with big competitions, we get very scared at first because we almost like know already that we're not going to uh, win or that we, we may have doubts that we're not going to go anywhere with this. But I think that we will never know if we don't try. So we just keep trying our best and just uh, try to, yeah, like put all of your hearts into it when you submit your project. I want to share that if you want to do something, các bạn hãy cứ làm mình cứ nghe bên trong mình á, thì cứ làm thôi thì mặc dù cái đề tài của mình đã được rất là nhiều thầy cô cũng có phản đối cũng có đồng ý nhưng mà chính vì mà mình tin vô cái cái bài của mình nên cuối cùng mình có đi sâu vô cái ngày hôm nay thì mình cũng hy vọng là các bạn cũng sẽ làm được điều đó là mình lắng nghe mình ghi nhận nhưng mà mình đừng phải tin vào trái tim của mình just don't don't be nervous if your project will be accepted from others or not, just be yourself and uh, be brave to express what you think inside. Submit your project and join this competition and compete for others, be the best of yourself, become the next me and others finalist. Yeah. Uh, I encourage the next generations of the IDA applicants or the IDA competitors to be bold to be radical and to be dynamic because you have to be you and at the end of the day whatever happens you could transcend your story to the world transcend your design to the world and make this meaningful impact that would last forever Ex explore as much as you can and believe in yourself when you join it, it can give you some fruitful experience and also you have the chance to meet people from other countries. You can um, learn their language, learn their culture. I hope everyone will more this is a must like you must focus your uh, studio or everything like based on the next idea this is a must experience for any designer it's really um, have the good opportunities for us in the coming years i think i really should push them because uh, this experience really really changed a lot of things regarding uh, how i see the world and um, it will really provide them an edge as well when we became, become professionals after we graduate. So. Uh, I think either is a very good platform for you to uh, showcase your project. Uh, and also it is very, like also the price also is very, very good. And uh, I think the journey is very uh, memorable. So yes, just John. Uh, I advise to my, uh, my juniors to participate. First, you have to compete. If you compete, you will improve yourself. So if when you, are, uh, you will reach this level, you will be the winner. So compete and learn from other participants and work hard. If you have crazy idea, maybe you just have to join this competition. <laughs> 重点是就是在比赛的过程有非常完善的这个制度跟流程，从我们到从台湾决赛到国际赛的过程，我们可以知道一个非常国际性的比赛要如何进行，包括跟工作人员之间的配合，所以非常鼓励我就会回去鼓
ค่ะก็ถ้าเกิดว่ามามาเข้าร่วมกับโครงการก็จะทําให้ได้รับประสบการณ์ใหม่ๆที่ไม่มีในห้องเรียนทั่วไปค่ะก็จะทําให้ได้ประสบการณ์ดีๆที่หาจากที่ไหนไม่ได้อีกค่ะ Yeah absolutely like this is like a once a time life opportunity so you have to grab it and even I want to tell juniors to so start working on it because it need lot of work to present your ideas in on a different jury panels for the juniors i would say somehow uh, make it to the internationals and after that you make really good friends um, you will actually see like professionals and um, educated people from really good backgrounds like practicing architects who they give their feedback to you um, and those are really useful so somehow make it to the international <laughs> any project that you guys do always have a root for it always remember where where it come from where what's the impact towards the community around you your circles so i think that's very important the most important first thing first when when you going to do a project 我觉得既然要做好一件事的话 他都会在你的努力的前行中慢慢积淀起来。またちょっと他のコンペを引き合いに出しちゃうんですけど、他のコンペだともう受賞がゴールで、なんかあまり大きな夢を持てないんですけど、このコンペはそのまずまず地区での